Hello and welcome everybody to the next episode of Let's Play Wizard 101. I am your host, Big Man X. And considering the fact that we are in a Halloween type thing, I decided to try to find any of the Halloween related things that are going on in Wizard 101. See if there really is anything that I could do, or if not. The, whoa, what do we got here? Young wizard, a rotten evil grows. Come see me in night side, post haste. Ooh, looks like we do have something Halloween related. So we're going to give Mick, Mindy Pixie Crown the chalkboard, the nails on a chalkboard, bitch. A little bit of a break from my impending wrath. So we're going to go and do this real quick. Um, sorry, I mean, didn't mean to push that button. So in the meantime, I'm going to give you a couple updates. Since it is the month of Halloween, I have decided to do pretty much all horror games. Like, all all this month is going to be primarily, like, horror-themed games or Halloween-themed games. Stuff like that. And, uh, am I even going the right way? Uh, oh. I don't know what I am. I don't know why this uh, had me do that, but anyway... Um, I'm going to be doing a lot of Halloween-based stuff. A lot of horror zit games, zombie games, stuff like that. Thought it'd be kind of fun to do something something like that. So, why not try it? I forgot I can't jump over this thing because this game is stupid. And yes, for all those who are freaking out, I have killed Lord Nightshade. So shut up. Alright, uh, what? Buttons, they do things that I don't want them to do. Leave! G get the f*** out. There we go. Okay, so, yeah. Also, considering the fact that I have revealed myself in the last, in the first Friday Versus episode, you might want to go check that. Seriously, go check it out. It, It's pretty funny. Well, some parts are funny. If you enjoy seeing me get pissed off while another person laughs like a complete retard, you'll enjoy it. So yeah, I revealed what I look like. So because I've done that, in the upcoming horror, in the upcoming uh, horror-based let's plays I do, in well horror time, I shall be doing fa uh, the face cam, where I actually have the camera showing my reaction. Thought I'd do that because f why not? I already revealed what I look like, so there's nothing really hiding it now. But I'm only going to do that for horror time, so don't really expect it for anything else. Got some other plans in uh, in mind for. Stuff related to that, so hopefully you'll enjoy. But uh, that's kind of beside the point right now. We're now going to talk to Dwargan. Dwargan. That is really his name. To me, he looks more like the hunchback of Oh My God. Duh. So let's just talk to him, see what he's got. Rotten in Nightshade. Okay. Young wizard, I've received word of spooky dealings afoot in the haunted cave. Spooky, spooky de uh, dealings? Are you sure they're spooky and not spoopy? Seriously, what the fuck is up with spoopy? I don't even know what that is, so. Yes, I know there's always spooky dealings in the haunted <laughs> cave, but this sounds especially terrifying. Oh, I'm sorry. It's not spooky deals in the haunted cave. It's spooky dealings in the haunted cave. You gotta be specific or else they're completely different things. They really are. I mean, you say it one way, it could be just all haunted things. You say it another way, it is what he means. And if you say it a third way, it involves anal rapage. You gotta be precise, or else everything goes haywire. The haunted cave is overrun with monsters, disfigured, vegetables! Oh, the horror! The horror! Giant, giant carrots going around killing people! Hunchback cucumbers going and headbutting everything! Tomatoes with an extra eye going! Wait, what's that? Oh, tomatoes are fruit. Uh... Evil celery going and breaking everything around, including itself, and tasting horrible. Actually, I like celery, so I think I'll eat that thing. No one knows where they came from, but rumor has it the grotesque greens walked there all by themselves. Oh, God, it's the walking spuds. 
Please go investigate the vile veggies in the haunted cave before all Wizard City is turned into a supernatural salad bar. I got the ranch. I'm dealing with this. Let's do this. It's time to go eat some vegetables. That didn't sound right for some reason. So, uh, oh no, I don't go that way. <laughs> yeah. The most terrifying thing that this game can come up with is zombie vegetables. Actually, now that I want to... If I put it like that, I don't want to eat any of those vegetables. They'll be rotten. Yeah. Anyway, let's go on to the comments of the video, because hell, why not? The first comment comes from a user by the name of... The f***? Oh. <laughs> when you read it as one word, it sounds weird. It looks weird, but it's... This... <laughs> user's co this... The user's name is not very important 910. Maybe that's why I don't know that name. It's not very important. <laughs> anyway, this user's comment is... You know those YouTubers who deserve way more subscribers than they had now? Big Man X comes to mind. Oh, really? Oh, you're so nice. You're so nice. I just, I don't deserve it. Shut up. <laughs> so the next, the next comment comes from a user by the name of, holy crap, this is going by really fast. Uh, I mean, no, that wasn't it. That's, that's not, get that out of here. <laughs> Where are these haunted vegetables? Oh, wait, no, I'm still not there. Sup, Jack? And now that I think your, hor your nightmares have been ingrained into your mind, I need to figure out where the hell I'm going. Oh, no, I know. I need to go into the next comment. The next comment comes from a user by the name of Super Sly... What? Super Slime XD. Super Slime XD. You gotta say it like D, or else it's not as funny. So, this user's comment is, Wouldn't it be cool if Wizard 101 was real life? No! No, it wouldn't be! That wouldn't be cool at all! Why? Because you would have zombies f***ing everywhere, wearing, wearing freaking suits and top hats. You would have zombie vegetables coming out from... Um, parts unknown. You would have a you would have a ma maniacal douchebag trying to go around and kill everyone, and this guy would be a pop sensation. So no, it would not be cool. And anyone who thinks that it would be cool, oh, well, that's your opinion. Mine, no. I am. St I was stuck on a pumpkin. How do you get stuck on a pumpkin? That makes no sense. Okay, are we almost done here? Okay. Sure. Five gold? My god. No, 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 no. Damn it! Oh my god, I got fucking. I got. I got pretty slippers! I do not care about the split. the pretty slippers. Am I almost to the haunted cave yet? I got stuck on nothing! And this game is glitched up the butt! Okay, so where are these rotten veg. rotten undead vegetables? What the hell is that? Okay, whatever. Seriously, stop doing that, whatever that is. It's not nice. You find several lifeless vegetable husks completely drained of their juices. So, we're dealing with a veget <laughs> vegetarian vampire? Are those bite marks? You have got to be kidding me. Is someone out there? Please help! You have got to be kidding me. We're dealing with a vegetarian vampire. That was a joke! Stop doing this! Stop making my joints- You're about to enter a dungeon. If you log out or leave for more than 30- Don't care. Okay, so... Dungeon raiding time! Let's go kill the vegan vampire! Or the veggie pyre. I don't know. Oh, thank 
could this? Um, who the hell are you? Please, you've got to help us. Help you with what? Okay, I don't care about those things. I have to care about those things. Ah! <laughs> Why does this game? Ah! What the? F there we go. So yeah, we had to kill blood bats, even though we all know they're booger bats. So, we're setting up to kill a vegetarian vampire. A veggie pyre. Something like that. I'm, I'm too lazy to come up with any good joke for that because, hell, we know this game didn't spend any time doing that. This is so stupid! This is really stupid! And considering the fact that this game is apparently going against vegetables, isn't it a good thing that there's a, a vampire going out there and sucking all the juice from it? I think he just summoned his little brother. Ow. That hurt. Yes! You're dead. Oh my god, it's Big Jaws. We should, like, team up and go kill Big Jaws. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what the hell's going on anymore. I'd like to make sense of this, but I don't... I, I don't think I'd accomplish anything. Really? Another one! Okay. I'm not really surprised there. Their entire deck probably consists of... Shields... Uh, the myth things... And then the bats. Gah! You know what, let's go into the questions right now, because we got... A good amount of questions. Uh, let's do the snake real quick. So, let's- so we're going into the questions of the video! The first question comes from a user by the name of... Breed... Breed Dominic... Breed Dominicana. Okay. This user's question is... BMX, do you ever wonder if you are going to have a theme song to your L Let's Plays? Actually, I really would like kind of my own little theme. That would be pretty cool. I do have one, and that's just a song that I found that I think is really cool. And come on, it is pretty cool. And also, I would just kind of like to have a personalized one. I'm not very good at making music like that. Uh, and if any of you are, like, really... G and if any of you are really good at writing music and stuff like that, and you think that you would want to do this, my god! That would be the coolest thing ever, and thank I you, would. I, thought those blood I, bats had I don't know how much sure. how I would be able to thank you with that. I just it would be really cool. You don't have to. I'm just saying. Thank you, wizard. Yeah, I, I didn't hear that. Okay, so now we go talk to. Let's go and absorb these leftover wisps, which I'm gonna guess are the souls of those bats that we just killed. Cause yeah, that'd be kind of fun. Oh, he's not talking. Okay, so. Name's Tarly. Okay, maybe he Remember is. Tarly and I were farming these caves, but everything went haywire, and now he's trapped. Do you have an accent, or don't you? I know farming in caves sounds crazy, right? But our innovative method of gardening requires darkness instead of sunlight. That makes no sense. However, I don't know if our process. Oh God, his hat was freezing through my body. But our cross it burns. Is pure evil. We tried to seal off the lower caves, but blood bats attacked, and our dynamite exploded too soon, uh, trapping- What?! You had dynamite in here?! Why the hell do you have dynamite?! That seems kinda of counterproductive! Hey, Bill! Looks like we got them... them cabbages taken care of. What do we do now? Hmm... I know! Let's blow them to f*** up! Brilliant! Now the rest of the dynamite we need to clear the blockage is surrounded by blood bats. Please, you've got to get that dynamite! Oh my god, I feel like I'm going to be doing this all episode. So let's just continue on with the questions. Which, the next question comes from a user by the name of... Minecraft Wizardman 108 And his question is... Can you let Bob do... Do own Wizard 108 video? 
Uh, I don't know. Maybe. I don't even know what the hell Wizard 108 is. So, pfft. sure, if you can find some Wizard 108, you can do it. Yeah, I will give you that privilege. Good luck finding any Wizard 108. I love it when I give him hope when I know that, that there is no freaking way that he will be able to accomplish it. Don't tell him, though. He likes to feel welcomed and important, even though he isn't. <laughs> so, the next question comes from a user by the name of Kosnikin. The name sounds familiar. This user's question is, Would you like to have a mini magical companion panda... Oh, wow, this is worded weird. Would you like to have a mini magical companion panda witch that rides bamboo rather than a broom? Uh... Yeah, maybe. That sounds pretty cool. So let's... So yeah, I wouldn't... I wouldn't mind that. Sounds interesting, at least. So, yeah, sure. Why not? Yeah, I'll, I'd like one. I really don't know what to say to that! That's a simple yes-no answer. Yes-no question. Really? They're summoning another leprechaun! Oh, it's my lucky charms! They're magically deadly! The next question comes from a user by the name of... Cadenator. The hell? Sorry if I'm, I'm speaking right into the mic there, so sorry if I was loud. This user's question is... Will be explained to you as soon as I get this attack off. This user's question is... What would you rather have? A Malastair pet or a Celestia shark pet? The Malastair pet summons a Malastair minion, and a Celestia shark summons a Celestia shark and gives you an epic spell. A.K.A. Chimera or Sabertooth Cat. Personally, I think I'd take the shark. That thing sounds freaking awesome. I mean, I hereby summon the powers of a star shark to come and eat your ass. Wouldn't that be cool? <laughs> yeah, screw Jaws. Screw Thunder Jaws. It's like, oh my god, it's a star shark. He's gonna eat everything. Oh god, he's eating everything. Ah! Ooh, stars. <laughs> uh, that was stupid. I apologize. I shall be punished for that later. Ah! Ah! I hate it when I say I'm gonna be punished for that later, but then all of a sudden I just. Yeah. So yeah, that happened. Thanks for that. It f***ing happened. Why did you have that happen? Why did you do that? It was a joke! You have no sense of humor. Oh, I got excellent sense of humor. So, up yours. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> what the hell? I never noticed that death animation there, but it's freaking stupid. Oh, when you have that bird speaks, fluffy rum, like little wing, shake your tail, and then you clap, one, two, three, four. <laughs> he just has, like, a random seizure, and that's why he dies. Son of a bitch! Yeah, I don't even think that I'm really doing anything to these guys. It's just like, hey. Bug. Here, eat this death spider. It's like, ha, that death spider's gonna do nothing to me. Oh, I got a seizure! Oh, <laughs> I don't know why, but I feel like I'm out of it today, guys. I really don't know why. Everything hates me! Okay, you know what? You know what? I'm not gonna be nice. Burn! F burn! I just all get the other. Whoa. Why is everything so dark all of a sudden? <laughs> I didn't even see any fire there! Did he even use fire? I don't think he did! So, yeah, he just had a seizure, and that just emphasized my joke even more. Like it, there we go. Heal me up, damn it! Also, I'm like one level away. I'm like. I'm almost at the level 16, which is awesome! Um. Okay, so. Dynamite.
Yay. That's all I needed, right? It really was. So I don't think I needed to get into that battle at all. So what the hell was I doing? All right, then. So, yeah. I, I'm, I'm failing to see any undead vegetables here. I think they gave us false advertisement. I was expecting zombie, zombie carrots, and they gave me blood bats. You failed me. Got the dynamite. You have no idea the horrors poor Carly is trapped with. Yeah, I know. Zombie cucumbers. Our gardening innovation was supposed to make us the richest and most famous farmers in the spiral. Really? I see no vegetables there, so I think you're kind of retarded there. After a promising start, we started finding vegetables drained of juice. Naturally, we suspected the blood bats. We were wrong. It's Count Spadula. The blood bats weren't after our veggies. The veggies were after the blood bats. Oh my god! That is so freaking stupid! The crops are. I swear to god, that said crap. Lizard. Please, you've got to clear the blockage and rescue my dear brother! Okay. So we're gonna go and kill vegetables that are after bats yep there it goes there it go. my I just snapped I just stepped so from now on I am no longer big man X I am Zodan the unbounceable <laughs> hey here's a good idea let's just stand right here Now, normally, Big Man X would go and question the fact of how I was able to survive a dynamite standing in a dynamite explosion. But, Zodan the Unbounceable gives not one f**k! Hey-hey! Dance party time! Dance is over. We are going into unending darkness. We are perfectly safe. Must kill Wisp with seizure. Okay, we're good. Holy crap, I ended up on the wrong right way. Yay! You're not Tarly, you're a wizard. Even better! These undead veggies are trying to Call it! Fucking called it! Undead carrots! Eat it! Eat it, you undead assholes! I shall eat you, and then I shall feast on the souls of everyone else here. Wait, where did you two come from? You all need to die. This is how Zodon the Unbounceable operates. Not one thing shall survive. Questioning how carrots are able to summon a freaking ve freaking scarab. Is not something Zodan the Unbounceable questions. Cause Zodan the Unbounceable gives not one fuck. Dance party! Dance party over. Now then, Zodan the Unbounceable shall attack this thing! Eat it, zombie carrots! Do the zombie carrots have mustaches? Of course, Zom all zombie carrots need to have mustaches. It is so decreed by Zodan the Unbounceable. Zodan the Unbounceable laughs at your failed attempt to kill Zodan the Unbounceable. The Zodan the Unbounceable is fucking annoying. Dance party! Dance party over. Zoda the Unbounceable thinks that I thinks that he needs to go and summon a shark. Zodan the Unbounceable shall have a lot of fun.
Zordon the Unbounceable is not afraid of zombie radishes. It is something that Zodan the Unbounceable shall shove up America's butthole. Okay, why the fuck are there so many scarabs? Is that the only thing they can summon? Oh, hey, another fucking scarab! Isn't that great? Don't you agree? Because there has to be a fuckload of zombie scarabs. Zodan the Unbounceable is not one bit pissed off. Zodan the Unbounceable shall go and kill every single one of these. And another scarab. It isn't a it isn't a, de a desert scarab this time. No, it was one made of ice. Oh my god, something that isn't a scarab. Thank you. And now the pixies are coming out. Yay! Zodan the Unbounceable thinks that he is f***ed. I do believe that is the right time to cut it off for now. Hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to check me out on Facebook and on Twitter. Also, don't forget to put a comment in the comment section below as well as a question and a poem. Zodan realizes that there was a poem time. This was no poem time. Zodan the Unbounceable does not care. For this is Zodan the Unbounceable, not Big Man X. So, until next time, I am Zodan the Unbounceable, and I'm off to kill the neighbor's kitten!